you, uh, you know, Ted Cruz is coming into the, is becoming the front runner in Iowa. And I think something that's really ironic about what he's saying about refugees is that he, his family himself were refugees. His father was a refugee from Cuba. I mean, do you think that uh, senators like Rubio and Cruz, who are sort of looking at refugees as sort of a, you know, a political tactic against the Democrats, do you think that they are sort of standing in the way of their own history, of their own people's history, of their own family's history? Yeah, I think that they are doing great damage to everything that America stands for and everything that they benefited from that was offered by America to uh, their families, uh, particularly Senator Cruz. I mean, his father is a Cuban refugee. And then uh, Senator uh, Rubio, his parents are refugees from, uh, from Cuba and to want to slam the door on refugees wherever they might come from, just discriminating based on where they might be coming from, uh, is just totally, um, it's terrible, it's, it's bad, it's uh, deplorable, it's detestable, and uh, it's unconscionable, and, uh, and they're doing it knowing full well that they are uh, trying to stoke the fears and ignorance of people and the prejudices of people. They're playing to those lowest instincts of people just to turn out votes for themselves and at great expense to the very people who seek refugee status from us. These people would not be here unless they had, unless they had been driven from their homes, and um, unless, just like their parents, uh, there was nowhere to turn but America, and uh, America should do its part. Uh, and 10,000 refugees from, uh, from a country with 4 million refugees is just a, a drop in the bucket, and, um, but we can, we can do better but we can certainly accept these 10,000 with open arms, particularly since most of them are children and some are just babies. All right.